Hi everyone, this is Juliana and I'm here to share with you guys another uh, Tilda Magnolia Christmas card that I made. I'm seriously on a roll making these cards <laughs> because, you know, the holidays are coming and um, I am going to be giving away some of these cards to um, my friends and, and family. So, like, um, I'm really excited about making these cards and playing with my stamp. So, um, this one I used um, this paper collection here, which is by Melissa Francis, and I love this paper collection. It's so beautiful, very shabby chic, and it's called Deck the Halls. Um, really gorgeous papers, like really traditional colors, like reds and greens, but they also have like these really gorgeous images here. So it's like very like vintage Christmas like, really super gorgeous pages. And like the green and the music sheet. I absolutely love this because I'm like a really, really big fan of um, music. So there's that. And then the green. And then this page here is like one of my favorites. So really gorgeous paper. So I wanted to create something with those colors. And here's my six by five and a half card. And she is so adorable, you guys. So this is another um, Tilda Magnolia stamped. And um, you can find these stamps, you know, pretty much anywhere. Um, any scrapbooking online stores. Or you can just go to uh, Magnolia Licious website. And I will put the link of... Um, the website below for you guys to find them um, because I know some of you um, were having a hard time finding these stamps so I will go ahead and put the store that sells the stamp so this is so gorgeous you guys I love this card so um, I used the paper collection and what I did here is I just added some glitter so I just wanted to look, make it look more like Christmas. Added some glitter there. And then this is a Spellbinders die cut that I cut out. And I also used some glitter there and some um, red stickles in each little um, tiny circle there. And um, that was given to me by Nancy. So thank you, Nancy. Like, I love those red stickles. Really cute. And then here's my little Tilda. I color her with my copper markers. And she's so cute, you guys. Like, I really love her. I wanted to um, stay with the red color for her. And she's just sitting in there in this little two uh, red punzeras that you can find at Wild Orca Crafts. Really gorgeous flowers. And then a little deer. And then here I just cut a little square from the paper collection, the, the music notes. And I just kind of like glued it in there. And then over here on the bottom, I added a little bow using some seam binding. And then I used one of my favorite Christmas trims, which is like these deers that kind of just go across there, like up in the air. So really gorgeous. I love this trim so much. Very nice and very Christmas. So love how that turned out. And then on the inside, I didn't do much here. Just put some paper um, collection in there so I can write my message in here. So I left her pretty simple, but... At the same time it looks very elegant so really love how that turned out and i hope you guys like it too so let me know what you think um thank you so much everybody for watching and i will see you guys soon with a couple of other cards bye bye everyone